Welcome back everyone. Students are getting a chance to eat the food they're actually growing at the school. That is cool. Yeah. 41 NBC's Carly Shabuz explains how Houston County Schools are preparing 6th, 7th, and 8th graders to become future farmers. Growing up as a kid, many children wonder where the things we eat come from. I caught up with a group of students who say they've learned how to grow their own food and be more responsible. I grew up on a farm and now like when I go to my grandparents house I understand that my grandpa's doing what he's herding his cows. Seventh grader Ashton Johnson is one of many students at Huntington Middle School who is learning something that will change her life forever. It really opened my eyes to a lot. These students are part of FFA or Future Farmers of America. It's a club that teaches students how to become leaders, work together, and learn the fundamentals of farming. It's helped me discover myself and grow as a person and like really get in touch with what I like to do and what I stand for. And it's really like opened me up to be a more confident person. The students learn concepts and about different parts of the plants in the classroom. Then they go to the greenhouse for hands-on learning. They get involved with building raised beds, planting raised beds. They actually get to see the process from the beginning to the end, from the seed to the actual produce being uh, picked and picked, cooked, and served. Students grow carrots, collard greens, tomatoes, bell peppers, cucumbers, squash, and so much more. Some of my students have never seen the fruits and vegetables uh, uh, grown. And thanks to the FFA, that's now a thing of the past. Being able to grow my own food, food, I know where it has been. I know what I'm doing with it because it's my food. Working from in the classroom to outside helped me as well because you get to learn all the different parts as well as touch all the vegetables and plants. Making the learning environment an experience of a lifetime. Last year, students completed a community service project at the Warner Robins Rehabilitation Center nursing home. They built two raised gardens and planted them for patients. All right. <laughs> Some students say they're thinking about owning their own farm when they grow up. That's so cool. Future farmers. Future farmers. All right. Well, I'll take.